diva! Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Yemi, Yemi Asiana. If you're new, in today's video, we are going to be getting into some hair products that I just picked up from Target. Um, I spent a pretty penny on them, so I thought that I would share it with all of you. Now, before we get started, I just want to let you know that um, I'm no cosmetologist, I'm no pro, I'm literally just going through the motions with my natural hair journey. So I just picked up the most popular recommended products that I've seen from other YouTube videos and I just decided I want to share it with you. Um, so if you don't like anything, whatever, you can respectfully let me know down below so I can know to watch out for it. If you have any recommendations, let me know as well because I will be happy to try them out. But just keep it cute, keep it respectful or you will be gone. Okay, so let's get into this video. So. This is everything that I picked up from Target. Um, I'm going to go ahead and go in order. I got pre-poo, shampoo. Dang, I didn't get no moisturizer. How did I not get a moisturizer? I just realized that. Awkward. Okay, anyways. So, I got everything pretty much besides a moisturizer. Um, I have some already, but like... How you didn't get a moisturizer? Ugh, anyways. Um, so, let's get started. So, what I got for the pre-poo was... Also, let me know what is the difference between a pre-poo and a co-wash because I've seen pre-poos and I've seen co-washes, but from my knowledge, co-wash is when you just wash with conditioner. I don't know, but just let me know down below. Anyway, so starting off, I got this pre-poo from The Main Choice. It is herbal air tonic and soy milk deep hydration pre-poo. It says it helps to support natural hair growth and retention melts tangles to help minimize breakage and preserve moisture protects hair from cleansing manipulation shields hair from debris removal helps to smooth cuticles to minimize tears drenches dry thirsty hair with intense hydration delivers instant moisture to the inner core of the hair shaft restores hydration levels in dehydrated hair helps reduce breakage and minimizes shedding improves hair appearance and manageability infused with nourishing vitamins and nutrients gentle enough to use daily on all hair types so this is what i got for pre-poo um so this is pretty much going to be my first step in my regimen now going on to the shampoo um this is a shampoo that i used to use when i was way younger this is really the only brand that i really know and remember to have in my household um i was relaxed most of my childhood so this is what i use but it is the ors olive oil moisture restore creamy aloe shampoo and it is infused with aloe vera for rejuvenating moisture it says it gently cleanses and detangles the reason i got this shampoo um and this is the only one that i got but the main reason i got this one is because i wanted to have a clarifying shampoo um so some shampoos strip harsher than the others um and this one is one that is known for that and right here it says removes product buildup so i got this for not like weekly uses but for um like when i'm taking out a braided style for example when i take this down i want to really make sure that i get all that dirt oil debris and buildup off of my hair and my scalp so that is why i got this one it says it removes product buildup without stripping hair, leaves hair soft and tangle free, can be used as a neutralizing or clarifying shampoo. So key terms, um, clarifying or neutralizing and for natural and relaxed hair. So this is why I got this one. Once again, not for like my main one, but for like when I really need to clean my hair. Um, and the other times when I'm just cleaning my hair like a uh, weekly by weekly regimen, I got the Miel Conditioning Shampoo for dry and curly hair types. Um, so I chose this one because this is a real popular one. And these are the ones that I've seen a lot of the YouTube girls using right now. And then my sister said it's awesome. My sister said that her hair so I was using it on her hair recently and she really liked this. So I decided to try this one out. Um, so it's our rich conditioning shampoo for dry and curly hair types. It's a gentle cleanser that contains rich moisturizing agents to soften and strengthen hair. Our shampoo contains natural and cert certified organic ingredients including babasu oil, almond protein, and hibiscus extract. Ba babasu, I'm pretty saying, probably saying that wrong, I'm so sorry. Babasu oil is derived from a lightweight Amazonian palm fruit. Almond protein provides strength and elasticity while hibiscus extract provides shine and manageability. Made with certified organic ingredients. 
this is one that i'm excited to try no parabens no sulfates no par parabens no mineral oil no synthetic colors no dea and no animal testing so i'm excited to try that out now following that um i've seen what is her name i can't think of her name on here but she was like one of the first natural hair videos that channels that i found it's like ole clay or something i can't remember it but i'll try to link it down below if i remember but she put me on to the aussie moisture line like literally after i watched her video everybody's um i noticed everybody was using it but she was the first person who i was like aussie use that so she uses the aussie miracle moist conditioner with avocado and australian jojoba oil so they have a bunch of different ones they have if i'm not mistaken like a coconut just different ones you can try but she swears by the avocado one so she definitely influenced me to try this out because she was raving about it so i got the regular conditioner and then i got the three minute miracle moist deep conditioner with avocado and australian jojoba oil and it says this is paraben free um so the conditioner i'll be using this one on like a weekly basis or like if i need to co-wash my hair in between my weekly time then i'll be using this one and for the deep conditioner i'll probably use this like once every two to three weeks or maybe like once a month not really sure let's see if they have anything cool it says dry hair looking for a hydration miracle we've got you covered our miracle moist conditioner helps protect hair against breakage and hydrates giving your hair amazing slip through your finger softness and that's one of the main things she was saying she says the slip through is amazing um let's see what does the deep conditioner says we've infused avocado and australian jojoba oil into our nourishing three minute miracle formula you'll get three times the moisture in just three minutes versus an ordinary conditioner so yeah nothing really amazing to read from here but yeah she swears by it so i'm gonna go ahead and try this out and let you guys know what i think now i can't believe i didn't get a moisturizer but i'll just get up real quick and show y'all for my leave-in conditioner, um, I'll be using the Camille Rose Honey Hydrate. Um, and this is just from her leave-in collection. It says step one, but girl, I didn't get anything else. I just got this. Why oh, is it so blurry? So, I've seen, like, literally every natural girl is using this. So, let me smell it. What does it smell like? Oh, it smells good. And they said it's best to use um, on soaking wet, hair, soaking wet hair, so before you get out the shower, even though it's a leave-in conditioner. Use as a leave-in on freshly conditioned hair, then style as desired. So nothing amazing here. <laughs> but yeah, I'm excited to try that out as well, because literally every video I watched, they were using that. So I'm like, okay, I gotta get my hands on this. And then, let me go get my moisturizer real quick. I'm actually upset that I forgot to get like a legit new moisturizer, but I'll probably just go back later but anyways from what i have right now is a shea moisture coconut and hibiscus curl and style milk um with silk protein and neem oil and it's for moisturizing to moisturize and curl to find thick curly hair so this is what i already have now which i'm sure you've seen thousands of times and then it says no sulfates no parabens no mineral oil no animal testing and no petroleum or does not patrol i don't know <laughs> anyways so that is what i'm gonna be using for the moisturizer for now because that is what i have currently and then when this runs out i'll find something else now i was using um um what is it called i was using eco styler gel and my friend was like girl eco styler gel been canceled like you need to get out of that we we don't mess with them they're pure alcohol you need to find something else so i'm like okay eco styler gel extra hole is literally all i know so i don't know what to get so i decided to try this aunt jackie's flaxseed recipe um it is the don't shrink line um it is a flaxseed elongating curling gel um and it says it has no mineral oil no petroleum enriched with flaxseed and wheat protein flaxseed rich in omega fatty acids promotes hair health from the inside out and helps to prevent dryness and flaking aunt jackie's moisturizing flaxseed recipe adds nourishment to hair while giving bounce and stretch to withering curls twists and coils so this is what I decided to pick up for my gel. Hopefully it works. If it doesn't work, then I'm gonna try um I think she's had like honey curls or something, something else that I could try. But yes, that is the gel. And then 
girl, I would have threw this away in my freaking car. Anyways, I also picked up some apple cider vinegar because I want to try the bentonite. Bentonite? Bentonite? I don't, I'm pretty sure I'm saying that wrong, but the clay mask. I want to try the clay mask, so I picked up some apple cider vinegar and I already have the mask, but I'm going to try that as well. And then I just got this detangling brush. Um, I tried to find a smaller brush because girl, I only have like inch of hair. But this is all they have. So it's for short to medium thick hair. Detangle, sturdy handle, deep reach, non-slip grip from Cantu. So yeah, I'm going to try this. And that is everything that I picked up from Target today um, to start my natural hair journey. I don't want to become a product junkie, but girl, I'm kind of like really excited, so I kind of do. But anyways, I'm just going to stick with this, the base regimen first, and then see how I like it. Um, and then I'm going to take my time going through each process to see if I do like it, if I don't like it. I'm going to do that little test to see if the um, products mesh together. I know you've seen it like when they put like a cream and then an oil and if it like separates and it's not good together and if it like goes into one then it's good so i'm gonna try that as well but i'm really excited for all of this and welcome to my new hair journey i'm about to go ahead and film another video while taking this hair out my head because girl it's literally been a week and it looks absolute mess act like you didn't see that but yeah i will see you guys in the next one make sure you like comment and subscribe bye